South Africa's political landscape is on terminus journey as the nation gears up for what promises to be its most fiercely contested national elections on May 29. At the heart of this electoral drama is the ANC, South Africa's ruling party since the dawn of democracy in 1994. In an unexpected twist, a new opposition party has emerged, throwing the political arena into disarray. This abstract party, the NK party, has irked the ANC by adopting the name of the ANC's disbanded armed wing, a symbol stepped in the struggle against apartheid. Adding fuel to the fire, former President Jacob Zuma, a prominent figure within the ANC, despite his terminus tenure marred by corruption scandals, has thrown his weight behind the rival faction. In a bit to stifle the growing influence of the NK party, ANC has resorted to legal maneuvers. They have taken the matter to the electoral court, arguing that the MK party failed to meet the necessary registration criteria. Additionally, the ANC is embroiled in a copyright infringement battle over the use of the Umkonto Asizwa name, a cherished symbol in South Africa's struggle for liberation. Amidst legal wrangling and political brimmanship, concerns loom over the potential for violence, especially in light of past instances triggered by political tensions. The specter of civil unrest hovers unanimously, with, the, with some MK party members hinting at drastic measures should they be prevented from participating in the elections. As the Electoral Court deliberates on the legality of the MK party's registration, South Africa holds its breath, bracing for a terminus electoral shutdown that could reshape the country's political landscape for years to come. However, the outcome remains uncertain, but one thing is clear. The battle for power in South Africa has entered a new and contentious chapter. For this and much more from From SA YouTube channel, be sure to leave your comment down in the comment section below and stay tuned for more updates.